Well, welcome to another edition of Take 5, and I think this is going to be a short one today, uh, but we're looking at Exodus 25, 1 through 9. As always, I thank you for taking time to look in God's Word. All right, so Exodus 25, 1 through 9. Now remember, Moses is up on the mountain, the clouds covering him, the people think it looks like fire. All right, and they're waiting. Uh, the, the elders are waiting like halfway down the mountain, and the rest of the crowd's waiting at the bottom of the mountain. So here we go. Verse 1, the Lord said to Moses, tell the Israelites to bring me an offering. You are to receive the offering for me from everyone whose heart prompts them to give. All right, so what we see here, and this is the case for us nowadays too, um, it's not you have to do it, but God said if your heart prompts you to do it. In other words, if, if your heart tells you to give, to God. God doesn't force us to, to obey him even, and he certainly doesn't force us to give to him. But here's here's what he tells them he's looking for. All right, verse three, these are the offerings you to receive you are to receive from them. Gold, silver, and bronze, blue, purple, and scarlet yarn, and fine linen, goat hair, ram skins dyed red, and another type of durable leather, acacia wood, olive oil for the light, spices for the anointing oil, and for the fragrant incense, and onyx stones and other gems to be mounted on the ephod and breastpiece. Then have them make a sanctuary for me, and I will dwell among them, make this tabernacle and all its furnishings exactly like the pattern I will show you. All right. Now, I told you this would be a short one, and here's why it's going to be a short one. I don't really understand the significance of all of these things. Okay, I understand gold is very precious, and silver is, and bronze is too, not as precious as gold. All right. And I understand there's different colors, and I understand we're baking a tabernacle and I know the tabernacle is going to be a very significant part of the worship of the Israelites and he is going to show the pattern to Moses later but why the specific stuff I don't know but you know what maybe if we keep reading we will find out but we're not going to keep reading today all right and I told you this would be kind of a short one but anyway he's, he's getting Moses set up you know when he gathers all this material to, to build the tabernacle See, there's a tabernacle and then there's a temple. All right, so that's what we're doing. Now, there's also going to be an ark. We're going to talk about that next time. There's lots of stuff here, all right? And I don't understand it all either. So maybe we'll actually be learning this stuff together. Won't that be cool? Hey, I love you so much. You know I'm not going to do one tomorrow. We'll do one Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, maybe Friday. But that would be it for a while, you know, because I'm going away. I love you so much, and we'll see you next time on the next edition of Take 5.